is MJK here, playing a little bit of, doing some Magic vs. Lakers, uh, a little exhibition matchup here, so we're going to uh, take a look. So we're going to play as the Magic, uh, let's see, yeah those blue ones are pretty sweet. Uh, we'll just do three minute, uh, I'll probably, I like the broadcast view, and then we'll do Rookie because a, I've only played this game a couple times, and uh, it's pretty hard, and the controls are pretty tricky to get used to. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and give it a shot here. Welcome to Staples Center in this Los Angeles, scene. as we get set for tonight's matchup between the Los Angeles Lakers pretty cool and intro the here. Magic. Along with Mark Jackson and Jeff Van Gundy. This was supposed to be the first time they ever had ESPN integration. Time, let's take a look at tonight's starting lineups presented by T-Mobile. Pretty cool graphics here. You know, so far so good. Good look to it. These uh, player intros beforehand, or pregame rituals, I guess you'd call them. Pretty cool. DC and uh, Dwight here. Nice little touch. This game was supposed to come out about 10 years ago, which is hard to believe. As this one gets underway, what's the game plan here for the Magic? When you face on our test, you have to be ready for a strength battle. He has a So this was the first year of the new still, commentary team. Uh, a little bit of lateral the year before, they had Marv Albert and Steve Kerr, I believe, and for NBA Live 10. And uh, so here, I'm going to change the uh, control settings here. Yeah, so this is the supposed to be at least the first year of the new commentary team. Um, there we go. And the commentary is okay. It's not great, but it's the first year of it. So here I am. I'm trying to remember the controls. It's kind of like NBA Live 10, but like, turbo button doesn't really exist, but it does sometimes. It, it can get a little tricky. Oh, nice little fadeaway there. When you watch this game, watch the animations. There's a lot of really cool stuff here. There's a nice one right there too. Nice little Euro step, kind of half Euro step from the and one. Cool little replay there. One thing you'll notice, there's not really a lot of replays in this game. Maybe because it wasn't a finished product, I don't really know. So there, I was holding down L2 and I don't know. Our it's just tricky to use these controls. To Brian. But if you try with the other controls, the default, it's to pass the ball, you have to press like four buttons. It's, it's insane. Bynum lets it go. Can't convert on his first shot of the night. To Lewis. Ooh, nice little cross. Stops on a dime and pulls up. This is the two. Right. To our test. So I was score. able to figure out how to get this game on my uh, modded PS3. It's pretty easy to do once you get the hang of it. Nelson. Right, Go and take. Ooh, the jump shot right there. Really nice looking animation there for Jameer Nelson's jump shot, I think. To Fisher. That's the one thing I will say, you know, people bag on this game, and rightfully so when the demo came out. I mean, it was bad enough where they wouldn't even release the game. Which I can't ever imagine that would happen again nowadays. But there are some things about this game that are pretty cool. They at least look nice. The play, the play is, like, kind of laggy. You never really feel like you're doing exactly what you want unless you're shooting it. It just... Kind of feels like you're at ice skates a little bit. So I'm not trying to say this is the greatest game ever, but it's, it's definitely not the worst either. I mean, think about all those NBA, NBA games that came out on the PS2 back in the day. The shot. NBA shootout, NBA in the zone. I mean, my God, there were probably 10 NBA games at one point. Just pump fake again. Pump fake seems to work quite a bit in this game. When you think about those games and... Like I said, I played this a couple times, but Lewis fires it's not bad. three on the clock. That's a great shot. Maybe that's because Defense, it was free. You can't do anything else. To our test. So I'm kind of getting the hang of it here. Let's see. Sweet Probably gonna myself. And Andrew Bynum with the jump shot knocks it down for two. 
Nelson setting it up. Beatrice against our test. So yeah, people dig this video. I can uh, we can do whatever we want with it. We can do you know, some different teams through the menus, the game modes. It'll count if it goes. I know a lot of them are tied to online, which obviously is not working. Never did. But I mean, this franchise and um, FIBA World Championship. So anyway, nice little replay there. Like, that's a nice looking jump shot, if you ask me. I mean, I'm a big, I'm a big fan of the ESPN graphics. Always have been. Going back to NFL 2K5, I mean, the authenticity of it. Always been a big so drawing point for me. Always wish NBA 2K would we'll get a like a TNT or well, TBS right, and or TBS. You don't get a real good or even ESPN. I mean, go, but it was well it so much better in my mind. Close that kind of thing. I thought solid early on initially, initially anyway. offensively. Teams got involved inside outside so, attack, crossover. creating something that's going to pay dividends down the stretch. The catch and fire away from downtown. See a defense. There's not like a defense button that I can figure out. To buy them. Kind of just floating around out there. Turbo doesn't really exist, especially oh, on defense. Dangerous pass, almost a steal. That was a nice look. Deep corner shot. Gets it off. Steve That's Blake. a two-pointer. It's good. You want to win big in this league? Get guys. And one thing I definitely think is really cool about this game. Kind of like I remember being like ten the same way. And then the jump arena and atmosphere. Over the and not this is just in. exhibition, but excellent ball movement around the perimeter. You can hear it in the background. It nice just feels like you're, the you're there, you know. Crowd chance and that kind of thing. Just gets it off in time. Can't Oregon connect. And still looking for that. They seem to cheer the when they're supposed quarter. to. It's hard to close out on great shooters. You know, just, tremendous job cool right there. there, getting his hand up, mirroring the ball. No holes there. Mm. Brian fires away for two. Yeah. To Duhan. Nice Four movement top. around the perimeter. Right there. That's Q Richardson right there. Yeah. Fade away. Oh. It's blocked. Yeah, I'm not so good at this game, so bear with me. It's a loose ball. There we go. Reaches in. It's stolen. Kobe shut me down away. pretty quick right there. Two pointer. Walker. The Lakers come away. Five rebounds. Again. To the rim. Can't hit. I liked how they pushed Something the ball I right there in transition. Kind of a lot of missed Created an open opportunity game. at the basket. Again, I only played it a Just times, not strong enough to finish the play. Something that's stuck out. There and the go. paint, Odom. Air ball there. At some right point, you got to give credit to the defense. And you take a look at the defense being played. That's, that's also played a few steals. Although I do have it on rookie, so maybe that's why. That's going out of the way to put forth the type of energy and effort that it takes to get stuck. The great defensive teams in this league are committed to playing 24 seconds of defense on every possession. You wear teams this down. Particular and announcer the way I've always been a big fan of. You give no real life. open shot. Great contest uh, right there. All good together. Give the defense it's credit good, yeah. for making it. Oh, the commentary, but find a jump shot. That's cool. And that'll be the first half comes to an end. The Magic down by two. We'll have more Monday Night NBA on ESPN and EA Sports after this halftime break. Here, yeah, top performers. Well, well, back to the Staples Center. Nothing the much there. Just a to get but again, This game never came out. So Jim Van Gundy and Mark Jackson, Mike Green on hand. Orlando's had an unusual first half, very poor shooting, but they're still in the game. What gives? Well, the good news is you're still in the game. Mama said there'd be days like this. You're going to struggle from. All right. All right. Whoops. There's VC Order with the crossover. Test. Give it up. To Beatrice. Mm -hmm. Ball knocked out of his hands. Oh, he gets the steal. 
Lots and lots of steals in this game. I'm struggling here a little bit, but see if we can pick it back up. To our test. Goes to the goal. Foul is called. It'll be against Lewis. That'll be his first. And he'll head to the line to shoot two. Oops. That's the first one. Good recovery. Gets the second free throw. All right. We're still in it. Let's see if we can uh, get on a run here. Oh, he nice. Woo! <laughs> There we go. That was sick. Beats his man off the dribble and then finishes. A little hesitation right crossover to the jam. The that was cool. Free, that alone was worth it. Oh. Whoops. That's what I'm talking about with the turbo button. You can like hit R2 and X and it'll do that. It's kind of tricky. Or I'm just not good. One and two. All right, got some momentum here a little bit. Gets it to go. Yep. LA up by three. See, like the crowd Jamil cheers Nelson right away, which is nice. It's a, uh, I mean, I don't know it's how it's supposed to be, but again, this game's ten years old. It never came out, so. To Bryant. Oh, nice pull up jumper. Oh man. Kobe Bryant with six points. It's impossible to guard a guy off the dribble. Oh, feed. I did not mean to do that, but I'll take it. Dwight, rocking those blue and white Adidas, looking pretty sweet. Oh, all right. Take that trophy. Let's play some D here. Oh, no. Ooh, I'm disappointed. This type of defense ah. is not Shoot championship it up. caliber Shoot winning it. defense in the second half of the first Nice. Game. See, I tried to shoot that a little earlier, but it's like, no, it's not super responsive. Keeps the man in front of him. I don't remember how to play. Okay. There we go. Nelson against Fisher pulls up and Jameer Nelson, Nelson with nice gets it to go. Oh, fire. All right, let's do it. Let's it go for two. Goes nice. out of bounds. So it'll be magic ball. Well, there's a replay. Yeah, the replays are really kind of random. Like, and the ball's out of bounds and that sort of thing. You never get one right after a dunk or anything, like that Jackson Vince Carter dunk. That would have been really sweet to see on replay. Final seconds of the quarter just flips Ooh. it up. Third quarter in the books. The magic up by two. Alright, so we got a fourth quarter coming up here. There's that replay. That was sick. So yeah, this game, it's, I mean, I'm having fun playing this. It's definitely not the best game I've ever played, but like I said, there's some, some pretty cool things about it. The graphics are pretty solid. Remember, it's 10 years old, so As we're set to begin the final period, player models look pretty good. Hard to get a feel Shoes, all that good stuff. Been close throughout. I think the thing to watch for in this fourth quarter is which star player is going to step Just a little up. bit more responsive to the... It'd be no pretty doubt. sweet. Oftentimes, it's a make or miss league, and you want your starters taking the All majority right. of the, the shots the post. down the stretch. Brandon Bass, man, he's Shoots a baller. Oh, it's nice. The Suns pass nearly stolen. All right, we're at last four. Quick 20 second timeout. Jackson's made a few subs here. To bite him. He shoots. Soft touch against the roll. All right, let's finish strong. Let's get this win here. Man, the magic board pull team back down. Oh, fade away. 
four point lead for the Magic. This team was definitely legit back then. Bryant really cool team to Gordon. play with. I remember playing with them on NBA Live 10 all the time. Oh, nice Ooh, get that out. That was a pretty cool play. Nelson nice block animation. Oh. Right there. If they end up losing this game, they'll look back and say that was the cause of the loss. Nelson jumper. This is <laughs> That's some two. cool commentary. But another missed layup. It's all good. Still winning. Here's a steal. Oh, there's another steal. Can we get a dunk? For the layup. And oh, scores. a layup. You got to be all a right. running team all the time, not just some of the time. Keep pushing the pace. Keep pushing the tempo. Attack the rim, even in close games in the second half. Let's see, we get another block. Oh, he totally hacked him. No call. Can't take area. it. You got to finish those plays if you expect to win this game. Give it up. Come on. Fade. Oh, that's definitely the VC fade right there. That looked just like him. And I remember playing as the Raptors in NBA Live 2004. And then T Max is dunking on people. Oh, no. In the fourth quarter of a close game, that's exactly what you want. Easy basket opportunities. And now he's going to the line for a possible three-point play. They're All right. Three. We're only up by three. Let's hold this lead, boys. Nelson against Fisher. You can see the crowds get into it a lot more. Pretty sweet. Oh, shh. Man. God, stop doing that. Ooh, another hack. I think the animation's like an off the backboard alley oop or something. I don't know why it's even in the game. Lewis, and they come up uh -oh. with the turnover. And LA calls timeout. They need to talk. All right. Let's go here. Fires away. Puts it in. That's a, oh, my goodness. All right. It looks like we're going to be shooting free throws here in a minute. Hey, One timeout real quick. Some. You've got to try to force a turnover. If you can't force a turnover, you've immediately got to foul and force them to the free throw line. Because right now, the clock is your enemy as much as the score. All right. There we go. And Ron Artest is called for the intentional. And here we now have time to look at tonight's player of the game. Brand, player of the game. Find him. It would be nice if they had some stats right there. You know, points, rebounds, whatever. But... I'm sorry. There's a six second differential oh, the shot dangerous pass. Had to do it there. They stopped the clock with Oh, the yeah, finally some free throws. The free throws on this game are kind of fun. You just push the right stick up and just a little meter. Oh, it feels pretty cool. You got to get it in that top green bar there. You can also bank them in. I think I'm going to try it right here. Might regret it, but it's pretty cool. <laughs> I got it. It's kind of it's kind of a cool free throw mechanic, actually. Not overly simple. It's not overly complicated. I like that you can bank it off there. A little too much. But uh, let's see how we do here. Oh man! Get him for the foul. He had to do it. Stop the clock. This is what it's all about when you're trying to close out a close ball game. You've got to step up and all right. down. Alright, we'll just ice it. Knocks down the first one. I mean, these aren't super difficult. It's probably because I'm on rookie. He gets two free throws, so they but it still the feels good to three. shoot those free throws. Three -pointer. Oh, oh man. Kobe's gone cold from no three. I don't think he's made one. Alright. Looks like we locked the it up. The first free throw. Bynum with the rebound. Oh. Goes one for two. They now lead by four. Fisher hooks it up for three. Get in there. <laughs> this one comes that was to ridiculous. An and one of the key differences well, yeah. turnover margin. Uh, yeah, this game, like I said, this game's pretty cool. I won. It was a close Angeles game. It was fun to play. 
Play a couple streaks in there. This has been a presentation of ESPN it's not bad. Like, EA Sports. I'd be more than happy to make some more videos of this game and EA check out Sports some of the other features this and modes and stuff. For I uh, hope everybody Staples enjoyed Center it. In Los Angeles. Let me know if you have any requests or uh, anything else you might want to see. Action Sports. Peace out, guys.